Thank you very much, Alan. Oh, my, I think my, my we have pleasure. really touched base. We I could have discussed with many other things. I want to summarize, actually, yes. just uh, that uh, we have met with uh, Dr. Alan Krivier, who is the founder of uh, Structural Interventional Cardiology, who touched on several things. And uh, number one, I think, is uh, the story of how the TAVI was uh, brought uh, to us and uh, 21 years ago by you and uh, the fantastic patients who have contributed to, the, to this breakthrough technology. Oh. And we have discussed about how balloon expandable valves are preferable in younger patients who have longevity and the lifetime management of uh, aortic stenosis. Uh, first of all, to keep the patients in the center of, uh, of the team, heart team approach and consider surgery as the first time approach in younger people and using uh, surgery as well in bicuspids. And if those are not surgically uh, operable patients, offering a balloon expandable valve as the first step and uh, which will help in future TAVI and TAVI. Uh, patients uh, also will benefit from uh, having some sort of commissural alignment in people who have low coronary heights. And I think uh, we also talked about low pacemaker rates and uh, how India has really advanced in the valve yeah. technology by producing uh, my valve uh, with intermediate sizes, uh, with the commissural alignment, with extra large valves and uh, the registry that in Vicus, which uh, here also has shown uh, how a balloon expandable valves were able to actually uh, reduce uh, the risk of paravalvular leaks and pacemaker rates uh, as compared to other uh, valve types that are available. And with that, uh, I want to thank you very much and it's thank a great honor to be with you today. Okay, thank, thank, you. You. thank you. Thank you. Thank you.